Okay, we're gonna talk about this goulash thing because apparently you have some very strong opinions. I love opinions my when goulash. It, yes, <laughs> so we're gonna talk about that now because you believe that once you put potatoes in it, it's no longer goulash. Yes, you cannot have goulash. Once you put potatoes in something, it's it's a stew or a soup or something, but it's not That's goulash. not true. That's not true. Goulash can have potatoes in it, just like it can have carrots in it. That's the way we make it well, back then it's home, not, too. Then it, well, then it's not goulash. As soon as you put potatoes in it or carrots or whatever you're of putting in it, it's goulash. not goulash anymore. What else would it be? Of there course is it's a goulash. Certain goulash has a... There is no potatoes in goulash. Goulash only contains well, that's what you meat say. That, well, how and you, onions. That's what you say, but what are the, why you say onions? Why onions? Why only onions? Why can't there because be other things? Because that's what, what goulash makes onions is. So special? It's onions and meat. That's it. And Who red sauce. You. That's you what say goulash it's that. is. It's onions you say and only meat onions. and red sauce. Why only red sauce? Okay, well, let's this hold on a second. Hold on a minute. Now, what, what ingredients do you put in your goulash? Let's start with that. My goulash is very simple. Onions, meat, and red pepper gravy. That's all you need. A lot of onions, a lot of meat, and red pepper gravy. That's the way you make goulash. Okay. Onions, meat, and red pepper gravy. Yes, red pepper gravy or paprika. People say paprika, but if you can get something a little spicy, you can add some spices in there, but basically it's paprika. Okay, so paprika, paprika. It sounds like nothing. It sounds like so plain. Okay, now tell us what's it in even your sound goulash. Like goulash. It's nothing. Okay, my goulash has meat, onion, carrot, potato. You can put parsley in. I also put celery in mine, and it has a vegetable based bouillon and you can add some meat bouillon to it as well. But essentially it's a vegetable bouillon with some meat bouillon in it mixed in. But there's several vegetables. You can include several vegetables in goulash. It doesn't just have to be That's meat and onions. That's not goulash. That's soup. That's some kind of a stew you're making. That's not goulash. Onions and meat. Okay, so your recipe has a lot of stuff in it. Your recipe is just meat, onions, and this red pepper gravy, the paprika gravy that yes, you use. Yes, that's what goulash is. Meat, onions, and red pepper gravy. That's all there is, and a lot it of sounds it. sounds like you nothing, like I say, that's like, that's like water soup you're probably talking about. Goulash has all kinds of things in it. That sounds like well, nothing. Well, you don't need to add a lot. Goulash is good as it is. Okay, all right, well, it sounds like a great debate. I... I've always had goulash that was very simple, as you described, with just meat and red pepper gravy and some mashed potato, a lot of onions, just like you described as well, and just some mashed potatoes. And, well, that's uh, not the only way to make goulash. I'm not saying it's the only way to make goulash. I'm not saying that at all. I'm just saying that's the way I grew up with it as well. That's just the way my mom made it, and that's the way I grew up eating it. Because so. that's what goulash is. Well, you should try it my way with all the stuff in it. It would probably be very good. You don't need the mashed potatoes. You put the potatoes directly in the goulash. It's I'm delicious. not saying my way is the only way to make it. That's it. I wouldn't be opposed to putting some potatoes in there. As but... soon as you add a potato in that pot, it's no longer goulash. Of course it's goulash. What else is it going okay, to be? Okay, 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 okay. Okay, this is not something we're going to settle here today, obviously. Well, leave it up to our audience to decide what they think goulash is. But an interesting debate nonetheless.